On today's episode, we'll show you how to install these arch moldings. Let's go. We just finished installing one side of it. As you can see, they came out pretty good. I really like how they look. And I'll show you how I did it the easiest way possible. Because you know what? The existing hardware that came with it isn't very good. The kit came with these metal clips and to be honest, they're not very good. They only hold it on a few places and the, and the locking tab isn't very pronounced. So today I'll show you the easiest way I was able to manage through them that I feel a lot more secure with than what came with the than what came with the kit. My method does require that you get a few more extra parts. For example, this is one of them. I got me eight feet of truck and SUV edge trim. We'll be using that edge trim to protect the contact point between the plastic piece that came with your molding kit and your paint. I don't want any scratches where that plastic pit, bit's gonna go. And you'll also need double-sided tape. We will, instead of using the metal clips that came with it, we'll be using double-sided tape to, we'll be using double-sided tape to attach onto the part. We'll also use a few screws to make sure that they're on there, but fundamentally the double-sided tape will be doing all of the work. So let's flip this car around. I'll show you how we put it on on the blank side and let's do it. This is our starting point. No arches on the car as you can see. And I'll show you how quickly this goes on. But all the work is really prepping the part before we stick it on. What we want to start with is cleaning off all of the edges that the new molding will touch, especially underneath here because that's where the double-sided tape will be adhering to. So we want to make sure all of that is clear of all of that dirt and debris. So the two things that we'll be doing to the arch moldings, we'll be adding weather stripping along the top edge and the other side of tape on the bottom. I've got eight feet worth of molding and each one takes up four feet. So what we'll do, as you can see, this is a U-shaped molding. I'll run it along the top edge, cut off the excess. And there's already adhesive built in to, these, to this molding. So you just want to press it all the way down to the edge. So this is all we're doing here. Work it all the way down. The adhesive's on the seam. And when you're done, cut off the rest. That's the first step. Super easy. You can see that the U covers the edge really nicely. Looks pretty good. We'll mock it up. Yeah, really protected, really protects the edge here. Next step, I'm gonna run double-sided tape along this edge, and I'll show you what that looks like once it's done. We've got it. Double-sided tape on the, on the bottom side and molding on the top. Our approach here is we'll start with one corner and work our way around, I'll show you. I have already put some double-sided tape on this side corner here so that there is um, so that the molding catches this little lowered. I have put some double sided tape here already. So that's the only item that's different than what I've shown. I have put some double sided here. I have put some double sided tape here so we can catch that little. So our plan here is to roll it onto the edge. So I'm going to take the double sided tape off. The tape is off. And what we're going to do. Just keep the arch real low like this and start at a corner. Keep the molding up against the front um, fender here and roll the bottom edge up. Now everything back here isn't touching. And then I just roll up like this. Then I just have to pull up. Okay. That's it. It's pretty on there. It's a lot sturdier than what the existing clips were. So this is, that's it, you're installed. I'm gonna prep the back one with the molding and the red uh, double-sided thing.
Okay, prepped. Double sided tape, protective molding. Looks good, right? Time to install it. Okay, this back one is a little different. Just gotta make sure that we're somewhat close to a hole back here so we can use one of the screws. So we'll just lock it up, make sure we're all good here. Okay. And I'm ready to take the tape off and do the same thing we did to the other side. That's it. The two arch moldings are installed. You can take a look at how that looks now. Pretty good. You see that side. I'm pretty happy how they came out. Take a look. Nice protective edge along there. edge there that's it guys thank you so much for watching we just installed arch moldings so far on our budget subaru build we've done our lift wheels and tires molding uh we're getting there next thing are going to be fun accessories we've got lights roof basket um and i'm excited to take it off-roading thank you so much for watching if you like it um please like and subscribe we've got more of this budget build coming your way so thank you